welcome to my first Let's Play. Actually, what I'm going to call this series is Making the Most Of. And so, this is Making the Most of Minecraft. Now, what I've found playing Minecraft is that um, what you want to do most of the time is find a world you can escape to. A world that, that makes sense to you. A world that, that, that you want to spend time in. Now this can this can vary from player to player. Perhaps you're you're a character who likes, or a player who likes um, um, efficiency over over anything else. Perhaps you're a you're a very creative builder. Perhaps you're a you're a uh, you're a player who who likes fantastical builds that that can float in the clouds. Uh, in the sky. <laughs> yeah, that's Tanner. Tanner. Tanner likes builds in the sky. And, but, but for myself, I, I, I imagine myself in the simple life. So, so what I've built here is, is my, my own little, little fishing and farming house. You know, and, and I've, I've decorated it a little bit here and there with. Hours and, I, and I've got myself a series of, of perches around the house that are that are well lit. So, so shooting perches, yeah. That or or the fishing perch over the lake. I you know, and this is one of my favorite places to to uh, spend time on a rainy day. You know, in Minecraft. You know, just over overlooking. Fun fact: In Minecraft, while it's while it's raining, the uh, the fish bite more often, and and you get much better catches. And so so this is my perch <coughs> overlooking the the little pond here that I found to build on, and and um, and you know I come back and I and if I happen to snag another fishing pole, I put it here. And here's my here's my little you know miscellaneous. Yeah, Tanner calls me an overpowered hacker, but the fact is, I I, I spend too much time on this game. <laughs> it's true, he spends all day on it because he yeah. just has nothing better to do. Right. Um. Um. And you know, I've got my own system of organization for for my for my farm items here for my for my fish for my for my you know coal for my for my furnace and, and you know miscellaneous here and there you know um, but again what you want to do is build a world that that you want to spend time in that that you enjoy looking at and, and there's a house I, I Thought I would like looking at the second thing I built while I was here was this barn uh, and and um, false. Yeah, you built the uh, what you call the second the castle. Oh, I haven't I haven't finished the castle, so we're yeah, we're gonna come to the castle. Finish. We're gonna come we're gonna come back to the castle. But the second thing I built here was this barn. And if you look it over, the the uh, the real um, the real uh, measure of this is in the details. And you see, I've got these trap doors here for nothing more than decoration. I've got I've got stairs here for nothing more than decoration. And if and if we go inside, you know, these are these are places in the barn that. That you'll hardly ever see, but I've got hay bales here and there, just scattered around, and and you know, general farm things that you would that you would imagine seeing in a in a in a barn for nothing more than decoration. I can't get down the easy way, so we'll get down the hard way. There we go. Yep. But as my animals started to fill up and, and I ran out of room in that barn, I, I found I needed a chicken coop. So I, so I built myself one, you know? Um, very excellent. Very excellent. Yes, I was kidding. 
what I'm about. Yeah! You know, and, and again, in the details, I've got these little, um, you know, uh, bird's nests in, in, the, in the chicken coop. And, and if you happen to just go in there and take a look around, it's in the details. Details. In the details. Um, I built this little water feature here. Um, um, and if we can get some of this out of the way, yeah, you, you'll get a better look at what's going on here. You know, I've got a little fountain in the center, some lily pads, and it's all, it's all, it's a, you know, a sandy bottom, um, pond with, you know, just a, just a few crops growing around it, you know, here and there, and yada, 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 yeah, it's just sort of a sort of a garden area but I but I like the symmetry of it I like the uh, symmetry. symmetry yeah symmetry is a big deal for me and my builds symmetry. Um, over here okay. over here I, I found like a simple build for for like a certain type of house okay and and I built that house over and over and over again, and this took some time, you know. But I did not have a village in my, in my area, and so as far as I've explored in any direction, every world has at least one village. Every world has at least one village. Yep. So he built his own and used zombie villagers. Fun fact, the more doors you have, the better chance of them breeding naturally you have, the better chance of gaining more and more villagers until eventually you have more infinite villagers. Well, I don't know about infinite, <laughs> but you can definitely create a large number of villagers in it, and it, uh, well, it's definitely... It's definitely dependent on the uh, number of doors, and and again, it, it you find a design that you like, and what I found is, you know, this uh, this uh, this combination of wood and stone that I really really like. You know, you get a stone base with some with some dark oak, and then some light oak wood paneling. And then some dark oak, you know, covering the top for the roof, you know. Add a little bit of glass, some doors, and you got yourself some houses. You know, um, but again, it doesn't have to be a super complex design or anything. Just a design that, that, that fits in with the rest of your theme. Um... Over here, I've, I'm um, I'm building sort of a shrine or temple to my to my nether portal. Da, 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 da. Where was where was that song when I actually needed it? Where was that song when I actually needed it? <laughs> yep. And and over here, I'm I'm trying to build sort of a castle. Now you know it's got it's got a lot of work to do, but but one of the things I've decided to do is limit myself to these andesite andesite stones for the uh, for the various floors. Diorite. Diorite. It's not andesite. It's diorite. We're gonna figure this out. We're gonna find out for sure. Do do do. Break a block. Check. It is diorite. I'm right. I win. Tanner wins. <laughs> I'm smarter at Minecraft than you. Yep. Are you smarter than a um, seventh are, grader? Are you smarter than a seventh grader? I lose. Yep. But but again, it's in the details. You know, you put some uh, shrubs around and try to try to hide as many torches as you can under the shrubbery. You know, uh, it won't catch on things. fire or anything. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. And summons blaze. Right. <laughs> summons blaze. Blaze noises. Some roses and bushes. 
But again, the idea behind Minecraft is to create a world that you want to spend time in. Create yourself a world that that appeals to you. And if that means contraptions that make it easier to live by, that's great. That's your thing. But if it's architecture, if it's, um, you know, architecture that appeals to you, if it's scenery, you can terraform the world, you can design what you want to it's not all about getting to the end first. It doesn't have to be that type of game. It can be, depending on your preferences, but it doesn't have to be. <laughs> but Minecraft is, is the biggest toy box, the biggest Lego... Basically, sandbox. It's the big sandbox game. If you don't know what that means, then... Means game where there is no real ending or purpose. It's just about exploration. Which is what one of the things I love about playing it. And you just sit there and do whatever. It's also not that challenging. It's for all ages, so of course kids of any type play it. Kids of all ages. Anyone from 2 to 40... Forty, forty-three. I'm older than forty-three. I can't play Minecraft anymore. <laughs> okay. It's illegal. Well, this is me showing off my world or one of my worlds. I'm so close to dead. Yeah, I need to get out of here. Run! Eat some fish. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and uh, if you like this video, click like, and if you want to see more of this, subscribe, because Tanner and I are always going to be here for you. Thank you very much. Recording every day over the summer, I hope. Maybe. Recording every day over the summer. You owe me that. That's all I want. I'll do anything. <laughs> uh, have a great day, folks, and keep mining.